Assalamu alaikum. This is Najib from Algeria and in this video I will show you my C code implementing Bill Mumford algorithm. So that's my uh, algorithm. Of course you can download, uh, you will find the link in the descriptions below uh, to download the, the algorithm, the C code. So you will find the, uh, a directory like this when you open you will find the algorithm and here here you will put the graph in file okay so the program read the graph from this file tx that's just a txt file so let's run and see how this algorithm work how my program work and then we'll see also a little bit about the code itself okay so let's open so let me run. So uh, of course, uh, before I run, I want to explain how to write your graph in a txt file. Okay. So that's the graph. This graph here. So this graph in this txt file, representing this graph here. So what you wanna do? Uh, in the first line, just to write the vertices, okay, the vertices name, and separate them by comma, okay. For example, here I have A, B, C, D, E, F. So A, comma B, C, D, E, F. And then write your edges. For example, here that's A to B and the weight here is 6 so A B 6 so just separate them by space okay so of course the, the name the name of each vertex vertex can be just one uh, alphabet or a string okay for example you can name a vertex by A B C for example that's a vertex so in my case, so I have just one alphabet for each, uh, for each vertex, okay? So let's run and then w later we will, we will enter this, this graph together, okay? So that's my graph, this is this graph here. So let's run the program. So I say that this program read the graph from this file graph txt okay so let's run to see how this program work so uh, of course in bootman ford we must uh, so we must define the source the source uh, vertex okay so the, first, the, the source vertex just will write it the first here. For example, I want to, here in this, in this graph, I want to search for the, for the reach cost, the minimum reach cost for all vertices from A. So the, so the, the source, the, the source vertex is A. So, because that I will write A here. So A the first, the first is the source. For example, if you want to write B as a, fir, uh, as a source, we'll write B as the first in this, in this list, in this vertices list. So the program assumes that the first vertex is the source vertex, okay? So here when I ran, so the, the program say that the number of vertices is six, so that's true, we have six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and the vertices are A, B, C, D, E, F. The start vertex is A, because I will write it the first here, okay? And the edges are A, B with six, A, C with four, A, D with five, A, B, E with minus one, C, E with three, and D, C with minus two, df with minus one ef with three and cb with minus two okay 
So, uh, the first thing we must initialize, I, I assume that you know how Bellman forward uh, work, okay? Uh, the first thing in Bellman forward we must uh, initialize the cost, the rich cost for all vertices. The source is equal zero and, and others are infinity. So B is infinity, C infinity, B, D infinity, E is infinity, and F is infinity. And, and here we start reducing the rich cost. Okay. So the current cost after reducing step one. So I I so here I call the function Billman Ford to reduce the rich cost. So I have here in this step, in the iteration one, I make a 0, B1, C3, D5, and E5, and F4, okay? Uh, so I start here another uh, reducing uh, step. So I find that A stay 0, B stay 1, C stay 3, D stay 5, and E, here it will be, it will 0. Here E is 5, and here it will 0. And F it will four. Uh, it was four, and now it's it's three after the step two. And then when I ran the reducing step three, I have that there is no change. Okay. So here I say just no change. So we don't need to reducing more. And we say that the graph has no negative cycle, because you know that. If, if there is a cycle, negative cycle, so when I reduce n, which n is the number of vertices, I, I, I find that the reducing change in the, in the cost. Okay. So, you, 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 you need, so I assume that you know, that you know uh, how Bellman Ford works. So, uh, and lastly, I, I will write that the minimum reaching uh, cost for all vertices from A is, uh, so A0, B1, C3, D5, E0, uh, e and F is 3. So, for this example, you can watch this video. You can watch this video. I use this example here, this girl here. Uh, implement Bellman Ford. So I use just exactly what this girl talked in this video. Okay. So just go, just search for for this video here. Okay. That's the example I I use in this. Uh, so in this example here. So let's let's write another graph together. Okay. Uh, so here also there is another, so here there is a negative cycle. Here in this example, in the same video, there is a negative cycle, which is this example, this, exactly this example. So let's, so let's implement it in our, uh, in our algorithm, okay, in our program. So let's write this graph. So let's erase this. So let, let's write this uh, this graph here. Okay. So we have so one. That's the name. So in the first line, we we, uh, we enter the name of vertices. So we have this is one vertex one two three four one to just separate them by, by comma three four and then what you must do you enter uh, the edges okay so that's one here for this edge here one to two with four so one space two and the weight is four and then we have the ver from vertex one to three with the weight 5 so 1 space to 3 space the weight is 5 and so on okay so for example from 2 from 2 I go with 7 to 4 okay so 2 4 7 
uh, that's it for two for three now so uh, with the th with the three I go to to two with seven okay and lastly with four from four I go to three with minus 15 okay so I will write it from four to three uh, with 15 okay so we have edge two three four five edge two three four five so I save you want to save and then so let's execute our our code so the same thing here what we say let's see the execution so a number of vertex is four so we have four and vertices are one two three four so that's vertex 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 the start vertex is one this is the start vertex because I always say that the first when we write this is the first vertex so that mean that this is the start vertex if you want to search with two is the vertex the starting vertex we'll write two here okay and one here okay and so here that's the cost initialization we make the the cost of reaching to one is zero because it's the the, the source and others the the cost is infinity so the current cost after reducing step one so i reduce here i reduce and then the with the step two i reduce again and for, for the step three i reduce again and here i say that the, the graph contains a negative cycle you know why because when i i check here here i have four vertices when i check reduce for the fourth time i find that there is a change because that i say that the graph contains a negative cycle okay so this example also explained in this video okay so I will I will put the link of this video in the descriptions below again okay uh, so for the code for the code itself it's well documented okay for each for example here I declare the structure of the vertex so here I say this structure holds the vertices which have a name and reaching coast and infinity flag okay so I explain what's mean this uh, this ver uh, this this structure and uh, the here is the the array of vertices and that's the number of vertices that's the comment uh, comments for each for each uh, variable and function here also for our functions i explain what each function do okay but here inside the code i don't write i don't write the just here for all functions i will write its explanation here okay for example for this function get vertex coast this function returns the coast of vertex by name that means that I call this function with the name of vertex and this 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 function returns an integer which is the current uh, rich vertex uh, the current rich cost okay. so that's it I hope that you find this video helpful for you if you want to download my my code you will find the link in the descriptions below uh, see you soon